up guys, I'm OG8 and I'm here to try to explain to you guys why the meaning of love is. Um, I'm actually a big part of like a huge, okay how can I explain it? I believe in couple love a lot. At first, I didn't care what it means, like I didn't believe in love but now I can actually show what it actually means. It, it actually it hurts if you don't have love. But here's the thing that I put down in my own book that I always have, which is it? It's somewhere around here. I don't know where it is, but it's around here. But the thing, um, I came down the cross in my mind and everything. It's about. It's a poem. He cries in the corner when nobody sees. He's a kid with a story. No one would believe. He prays every night. Dear God, won't you please? Could you send me? Could you send someone here who will love me? Who will love me for me? Not for what I have done or what I will become. Who will love me for me? Cause nobody has shown me what love. What love really means. Her office is crazy if Fiddle each day, she's a woman whose husband has run away. She will go to the gym after work today. Maybe if she was safer, then he would have stayed. And she says, Who will love me for me? Not for what I have done or what I will become. Who will love me? Me for me, cause nobody has shown me what love. What love really means, what love really means. He's waiting to die as he sits all alone. He's a man in a cell who regrets what he's done. He utters a cry from the deep of his soul. Oh Lord, forgive me, I want to go home. Then he heard a voice somewhere deep inside and it said, I know you have murder, and I know you have lied, and I have watched you suffer all your life, and I know that you will listen, I will, I will tell you that I, I will love you for you, not for what you have done or what you have become, I will love you for you, I will give you the love, the love that you never knew, love you for you, not for what you you have done, or what you will become. I will love you for you. I will give you the love, the love that you could never knew. I hope you guys enjoy that because it can't be hard with that one. <laughs> it means a lot. You guys have to. I'm telling you. <laughs> I know I talk weird and everything, but it's the way I am. It's the way that God me to become a guy who can't talk right. Yeah, most people will make fun of me because how I'm talking and everything, but at the same time, I'm not too proud because when I'm up there, high up there, in a high income, high job, proving life, proving each and each and every person by trying to improve them and try to help them out through life, I can easily say, see, yeah, I do talk weird, I do that's why I did make these eye movements, these mouth movements, but it doesn't affect me. I try my hardest each and every time to try to improve my life, including other people's lives, which all the people who didn't make fun of me. Hey, I just proved that you guys wrong. Yeah, I might be different, or I might be all weird, or I might be this other kid that you can only see, but the thing is that I try to know that if me on who I am. Who I am. And that means I care about people a lot. Uh, I'll do whatever it takes for them to be happy. I'll put other people in front of me. The thing is that I'm not perfect. People think that I'm perfect for someone there. I don't know why. The thing is that I cannot talk, right? Uh, high school, 
I barely passed high school. I'm not even sure how I passed high school, but I passed high school. Um, all of in high school, I don't really care. I didn't care about the school. I didn't care about education. I, I just didn't really care about life at all because I was like supporting life. But then until I met this one teacher, no, actually two teachers that actually inspired me to actually improve in my life, which is my special ed teacher, which is my speech therapist, because if they give me a book, I won't, I'll be like, what the hell, like, I can't understand the book if I read it like a hundred times off one page, it takes me like eight or nine times to read one page to understand that one page, which I, I don't know. But when it's more of like a hands-on, like a car, or like I'm trying to do the engine, doing all those other stuff, I can actually pick up real fast. It's more, I'm more of a hands-on person, which means that I'm not perfect like other people that could easily read the book and be like, oh yeah, I can do this. I'm not like that. Um, I, I love all kind of music. If you guys don't know me, I love all kinds. I love music in this place right here right now. It's called Jacob, Jacob and Kathy. They're like a, a Catholic band. Um, they're after my my favorite band. Cause like when I'm sad or depressed or down on myself or if I'm mad or upset, I put this on. I'm like, ah. Like at first I'm like, oh, you know, Effie, do and everything like that. And that, until I hear the band, I'm all like, what the? How you doing? <laughs> yeah, just like, yeah. um, um, I'm tall. Uh, dude, I talk a lot. At first, you know, when I hate a person, I don't talk at all. Because I'm more of like a person that is all shy and everything. Uh, I just, I don't know you, so I'm sorry. I make it awkward, which I am doing right now. But, I know. but when I do get to know you a lot, I do talk a lot, which is okay, I guess. Or bad. It could be bad or good. I don't know. Uh, I enjoy to go on hikes. I love hiking. Um, do I hike with gear? Sometimes, not all the time. Uh, when I go to the A, you guys been to Pandora? It's in California, and there's like there's an A on the hill, and there's like pathway to go to like that A um, versus Coastal Crawl, and you have to go back down the hill to get to the A. Yeah, uh, but the thing is that I don't take that pathway. I actually just cut straight up the hill because it's more fun for me. I enjoy it. Do I use uh, some gloves for my hands? No, which is just down for me to do because I could easily get my hands all cut up and everything. Do I use shoes for it? Sometimes. Do I use pants? Kind of, you know, all the time. I don't know. That's just me. I'm just some weird guy that takes life as a R-I-S-K. You guys know what I mean, but look at the ways. Uh, I go on jogs a lot. I'm just one. Come on. <laughs> uh, I play a lot of sports. I love sports. Any sport that you do or play, I enjoy doing sports. Um, I'm tall. Uh, I'm over 18, and I, okay, just comment down my age, if you guys know my age, therefore, uh, I, I'm a loving person, I care about people a lot, I respect people a lot, if I barely need you, I'll give you all those three in hand, respect, caring, loving, those are the three things that I'll totally be out for it. If I barely know you, I'm like, hey, what's up, dude? But until you tell me a lie or try to disrespect me, I have to know I'm like, hey, all the three just lost. Because I'm like, because most people say that you got to earn your respect, 
seems more like something Mary Gill might respect her. Like, like to become your life is more like, oh, who are you again? My respect? What? Who said that? Yeah, it's I'm more like that. Uh, I go to church every week. I'm like Catholic. My parents are not. They're more of a Christian, which is about the same as I but I don't know. Um, I attend St. Francis of Rome Church. It's in Azusa. A Z U S A. I, when I can talk, I have to spell out the words, so it seems like I'm in it, but I'm not. Meritria started a boxer. Oh, cool. Um, because you want to add me on Facebook, talk for it. I'll put off um, my name and everything on there so you guys put the ad or be like, hey, what's up, dude, man? And show them your videos that you're doing. Oh, hey, guys. Um, I'm trying to do a new thing and everything. I'm trying to help. Um, I'm trying to start up the event pretty much, which is for people who are not perfect. It's, uh, it's for you guys give me a topic each and every day that I only try to do, I only try to do topics each and every day, trying to show others, uh, like say, say the topic is hey, I'll try to think of a poem to do, or to just click up online, and I'll try to explain to it, which I'll also get the person who made the poem, their name on here to say that they did it, because I don't want to take all the things for like, like, yeah, and then I'll like, uh, but just to me how to do it, and I'll try to do like a huge video on it because I'm trying to get my name out there, but I'm also trying to get other people out there like me. I'm trying to be out there because how I talk and everything, how Twitter, how I improved on time and life and everything, how long it took me. And like, I'm trying to show other people that yeah, I do talk weird or I do better, I do. Faces, but it doesn't stop me to try to keep trying to keep trying to try to get other people to try to be happy in their life. So that's my goal in life is to try to bring other people uh, to make them feel good and to make them be like, okay, if he can do it, I can do it too. Like, I'm trying to do that to other people to try to bring them into it. I know that I'm not that interesting, but by time, I guarantee I'm going to be more fun entertaining and all this other stuff. It doesn't matter. Other times, I'll I'll go to both books and explain to you guys how to do all the like awesome wrestling workouts or the food. <laughs> I don't know, I'm just weird. Oh yeah, I forgot to tell you guys, I'm also weird. Trust me, I'm weird. You guys can't see me, I'm not weird, but trust me, I'm weird. Um, anyways, so, I'm going to go and think of a new idea to, to post up for you guys, I guess, peace out guys, and have an awesome day.